All right, today we're gonna do a review on a bourbon that reminds me of Todd every time we had a dance in high school. Stag. <laughs> All right, everybody, welcome back to 1090. I am Andy. This is Todd coming at you with another brand new release. Um, I had sorry dates. To, sorry I had dates. Maybe a one or two. Not all the time, Stag. Um, <laughs> but not just God. Stag. This is Stag Jr. that we're going to do tonight. Batch 16. Everyone is out trying to grab it right now. We were lucky enough to get our hands on it. You yes. found this one, which is fantastic. Uh -oh. um, Buffalo Trace puts this out twice a year. It is the alternative to George T. Stagg and the mm -hmm. Antique Collection. Only big difference really is this mm. is aged around eight to nine years and is supposed to be more affordable, but that is changing quickly. <laughs> $85 is supposed to be right, right price-ish for MSRP or 90 yeah. if you get that. Yep. If you get close to that, you found a honey hole because that's probably not going to happen. But. There's a reason why this is always all the rage. We've had batches of stag before. The 16 has been getting some pretty good reviews. Todd, tell us a little bit about the 16 and what we're gonna be sipping on. Well, yeah, it's 130.9 proof. So it's in between, I think, 15 and 14 where it was. It's mm -hmm. right around where it is. Just a hair uh, right. less than less, last right. year. Yeah. I will say one thing to hunt for this. You know, it was extremely difficult. And you know, I've had my hand on this twice, took it up, $300, $275 they wanted. That's ridiculous, and that's the problem with this. This is a, to me, $100, $125 whiskey that people go nuts for, and then it's upcharged by every type of store you're out there. So, And it makes it so hard to get. It is tough, that. you know, highly allocated, and it's one of those things where they're finding out that people are gonna pay it, and so the, the market goes up. But if you can get it, so is it worth it? Let's there, see if it's worth that's it. That's what we're here to find out tonight. Is it worth it? Look, Stag is, if nothing else, it's consistent. It's the same mash bill for mm -hmm. Eagle Rare, E.H. Taylor, and Buffalo Trace, but of course, at that 130 proof, this puppy's on oh. steroids. Yeah, buddy. So let's, uh, let's get a nose beautiful, on this and then take a look at the color. Copper color. I mean, that's a gorgeous color. Oh, and yeah. then the nose, Andy, you... <laughs> it's Stag. Ooh. Boy, it's, it's heavy. I mean, you get you get heat coming out of it, so I wouldn't, I wouldn't. But I tell you what, I get a lot of oak on this. You do a little bit of that burnt sugar kind of oh, coming through. Um, a little vanilla, caramel, even like a and chocolate you get heat. Like the don't don't. Uh, oh, there's look, heat. There's there. heat. There's you, heat you, on this nose, and uh, it comes through. But let's. Uh, smells awesome. It's a great smell. Yeah. It, it's that stag. Cheers, stag sixteen. Totally honest. I've had this for a while. <laughs> I've had oh, not for a while. I've had long. Four days. You're, doing, so you're doing pretty well. This is your second pour of this. You mm -hmm. did it blind on our live stream. I did do a blind. We'll, we'll actually reference you back. Yeah. I did this the other night blind and... Didn't know. <laughs> it is, the finish on this is, is Stag Jr., right? It is such a long, long finish. But up front, I love the oiliness, how viscous this is. Yep. Um, it's... Brown sugar oak is there in, yeah, the, in the taste definitely. as well, right? Real, real, the real thick legs, which I love on this mm -hmm. puppy. Uh, dances oh. on the tongue. Um, you get a touch of that, that those, those spicy it's notes, but really, you, mainly we're talking big red hot notes coming yep. through here, cinnamon, Ooh. and you get the gut punch in that Long good way. Like I, I, yeah. some people, you, you talk about it being aggressive. Aggressive right. is usually more in terms of being young. This this is refined gut punch, which I really like. I, I it is so warming. That finish is super long on this. It's a winter warmer, man. This is something I'm, to carry you right into the. I tell you, for 130.9 proof, and Stag Jr.'s, it's mm. such an approachable whiskey. Now, granted, if you're not into higher proofs, this would be a huge cut punch to you. But if you're looking no, at I certain, think it's an easy drink for 130.9 proof, right? Yeah. I think it drinks under that, even though it's such a long finish. And there's, let's be honest, yeah. there's other big barrel proofs out there, yeah. more accessible and less than this. So, yeah. I'm not going to lie to you. I think it's a beautiful pour, but let's do our past purchase and pour. Mm. Do you want to... Pass on this and say, no, nah, don't want it. Do you yep. want a pour of it first at a bar, or do you want to say, I gotta have it if I can get it for the right price? So, what do you say? Let's put it, can I put an asterisk next to this? Go for it. If you can find this for MSRP. <laughs> that's, that's goal one. Um, and I've seen some places that I've gone to that were out of it, had it for $99, right? Mm -hmm. That is a purchase one, yep. purchase two, purchase three, get three of them, right? Well, that's a problem people do. You go into stores <laughs> and they have it sitting on a shelf behind a case locked up and it's $300, it's a pass. I mean, I, I passed on it twice because of yeah. that. I found it for 110 and took it. So if you can find it, I think, for under $125, I think it'll a little bit higher, but not much. I, I don't know if I'd go that 125 high. $125 or um, lower, I'm saying it's a but I will. I will agree with you. If you can get it for close yeah. to MSRP, 
I would say gorgeous. this is a purchase. If not, um, I love this. Now you've had other stag and I, juniors, and I, and I would say if not, yeah. wait, because the thing is, what sometimes with these allocated whiskeys is they may mm. sit for you know they they go initially, and then yep. after time. They don't sell, and you were yeah. able to grab them. If there's, and you can try and negotiate them down. I would say at that point, go ahead and try and pick up a bottle. But there's other really good barrel crews. You just didn't run much the risk lower. of it going right. though, right? And somebody going in there and yeah, dropping. Some people it. just have to have it yeah. because of stag. Um, but for what me, what, well, I'll tell you, I did try it blind, and I said I'd probably pay upwards of 100 bucks for it, and there it was go. right around where it was. So um, I think it's worth the MSRP. Compared to other tag. stags, it's right up there. Right? Yeah, it's up there. It, this it, is really good. No drop off. I think it's great. This is it's really fantastic. good. It, if nothing else, they're extremely consistent. And considering I, you know, I mean, it's a contender for a I don't think we're going to have yeah. a George T. Stag anytime soon because I. Just... <laughs> it's hard. I, it's so anyway, um, yeah, I like it. So this is this is good stuff. If you've had it, you found it. Let us know. Comment. Tell, tell us your, your story. Thoughts. What did you pay mm -hmm. for it? What do you think? Is and, it worth yeah. it? You paid for it. And are there other batches that you liked a lot more or not? Just I you know, we'd we'd love to hear. Right up there. Um, and other than that, if you like what you see from 21090, please hit that subscribe button, click that little bell in the corner. It's going to let you know every time we got a new video coming out. Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, and Untapped. We go live every Tuesday night with uh, Glam and Drams, everything beer, bourbon, and rock and roll. We do blind taste tests. We have on distilleries, breweries, all kinds of fun yep. stuff. Um, and of course, uh, we thank you who continue to give us a super thanks uh, for supporting the channel because. These guys aren't free and no one's sending no. us anything, right? God, no, they're we, not. we appreciate it, so thank you very much. Mm. And uh, I don't know, Todd, mm. if you were able to pull out um, good pours like this, maybe you'd have more days with you. There you go. Hey. Wouldn't we go and stag? <laughs> <laughs> I need help, I guess, huh? Cheers, Cheers everybody. Mmm. <laughs> mm -mm. Hello.